Hey guys, it's me, Courtney. Um, of course, you know, you've seen that I've been testing out a lot of new videos and seeing who, which one gets more views, which one doesn't, which ones you guys like, which ones you don't like. And, um, I got this idea to do what I'm going to do today from, I'm getting what I'm going to do. I got an idea of what I'm going to do today from Elle and Blair, from Elle Flower, because she done, like, book literatures and, like, which are, like, reviews about the books she reads. And so I've been um, into reading lately. I don't know what it is. I had the reading bugged. But I've been reading a lot lately. And I just finished two big, great books. Like, in between, I finished, like, like tiny, like, 90, 138 two-page books. But, like, I've been reading, like, a lot of big-page books. Or, like, a lot of multiple, pa really big, like, a 200 pages book. And so what I'm going to do today is I'm going to do um, a book, like, not a book haul, but a book review on each one of them. Not in, I'm going to do them in one separate video. Okay. The first video I want to do a book review on today is this book. It's by, uh, I finished this one about three or two, two or three weeks ago. And, um, this book, um, and I'll show you guys inside of it. Um, this is the Reba McIntyre, My Life Story book. I know it's, everything in the camera makes the writing upside down. It's Reba. Reba. Okay, Re. And it seems like everything's backwards in it. Okay. But it's Reba and it's her, my life story and it's it it's a it's a good book. Um it has a lot of surprises in it, um, as far as of what like her Reba's past entails. Uh it has a lot of <coughs> I'm, not, <coughs> I'm not gonna say what, like bad things, but when you do read it, it will change your opinion. It won't change it much, but it will change part of your opinion of her because she, like, she didn't do, like, I mean, like, it just changes a lot of your opinion of her. And I'm not going to lie, and I'm not going to say it doesn't, uh, but it does. And so, yeah. Um, there was a lot of great parts, too, and a lot of not-so-great parts. Uh, the not-so-great parts of this book were... About re about the uh, when. All right, if you guys read it, go ahead and cut it off. If you guys read it, because I'm gonna spoilers. Um, the bad parts. I'm gonna tell two bad parts and two good parts about the book and each book I read. The first good part about it was, or the bad part about it, was that Reba kissed Charlie when he was still married, and then one time when she was rodeoing, her brother um, back walked up and said, "Well, have you heard Charlie and his wife broke up?" And he's like. She's like, no, and she's like, I knew it was because of me, because she just was drunk, and she won an award, and she kissed him. So, yeah, that's a bad part. And the second bad part was the loss of her band in 1991, uh, and so she, that, that, I think, was hard, because, and the thing I found hard about that is, Narvel, her husband, second husband, had to call eight families, I think nine or eight families, Eight families, eight families, and tell them they lost a loved one. And the night I read that, I read it in a night, or the night, I read that part of the book in a night, and I told my mom that night, I said, there would be no way on God's green earth that I could call eight families and tell them they lost a loved one. There would be no way I could do that. And it was just a hard night for Reba, and they had a memorial service. And what I thought was so nice is they had a fundraiser, and... A lot of Reba's fans donated to the families that were lost by the crash, or that people, the families of the people that died by, in the crash. And I thought that was really good that her fans supported that her too, um, on that too. Um, the good parts were is when she showed about when she had her son Shelby, Mac and Stephen, Shelby Stephen McIntyre Blackstock, which she had her son in 19, I think 80, no wait. 19, I think 19, wait, 1989, I think, February 1989, I'm thinking, when she had her son, Shelby McIntyre Blackstock, uh, and then, um, I don't know, tears are blowing up, I'm just, well, I'm not crying about the book, my eyes are watering, um, but, yeah, that was the part good that she had her son, and then, uh, that the good part was that, she, I'm trying to think of a good part, because there wasn't many, there's a lot of sad parts, too, um, uh, they, yeah, 
the good part is she had her son and she um she got married she got married to uh she got well the good part was that she got married to normal and her and normal been married so she had her son and got married to normal and second husband because there was one episode where charlie her first husband i don't even remember what it was because my brain's like not but it was something about where I don't know what it was, but it was something about her touring, and then, no, 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 I got this. She didn't want him to go, she didn't, Reba didn't want him to go to a show or whatever with her. And so, Charlie got mad and almost hit her, but he didn't. But, yeah, I think that, that too, which, it made it good that she married somebody that she liked, and somebody that would treat her right. Um, and I'm not saying that, I think Charlie was a, a bad temper person, so, she, I think, it was good for her to marry somebody that she's been married to. She's, she's still married to now. So, um, yeah. It kind of changes your opinion, but it doesn't really. And, um, yeah. And also, a fun fact about Reba. Did not know this. Until. Okay, I think Linda Davis signed on a record thing with Narvel. Did that too. But I was watching her backstory. This was way before, like, I think this girl was even born. Okay. I don't know if how many of you know this, but I was watching Reba's backstory, the one the backstory on GC, and I was watching it, and the girl that sang Does He Love You, Glenda Davis with Reba, the girl that's in Lady Antebellum, Hillary, that's in Lady Antebellum, that's, Hillary is Linda Davis's daughter. I had no idea about that, but Hillary is Linda Davis's daughter. And I thought that was a fun fact, and if you didn't know it, yeah. Hillary is Linda Davis's daughter, Hillary and Lady Antebellum. Uh, yeah. So, that's pretty much all about this book. Ooh, and I'll show you some of the pictures. Um, uh, I'll show you my favorite picture. I think this, this girl would have been really nice. This Paula K. Evans, I think. She's really pretty and she's really cute. And what I thought was so sad about it is she used to draw Reba, like, she was a painter, so she used to draw Reba's little, Reba little paintings, and then she died, so, yeah. And then, yeah, the, a lot of sad parts, too, and, like, the band, the glass that she got from the night at the band, Charlie got, um, part of it, so. And then after her divorce, she moved to Tennessee, you know, Charlie. Uh, and then, yeah, here's all her band members that passed away, and then that's pretty much it. Yeah, I'm trying to keep these videos under like 10 minutes so you guys don't get bored but that's pretty much it uh so yeah it was a really good book to read and i like i couldn't really put it down it was a really good book to read and i'd stopped it about a year ago and then i reread it again and then i read it it took me like maybe two or three months to read because it's a very it's um i'll tell you how many pages it is it's a yeah that uh it's a 303 page book, but it's a, if you want to read the disc, discography where she talks about her, like the war she's won, then it's like three, bleh, then it's like, then it's like three, then it's like 320, but I read 303, um, I didn't go very far, I went from the, um, the, polygamy or whatever where it shows like where she is now she finished writing this book so that's that's as far as i read and i'm gonna do the book for my next uh or my next book that i'm going to um show you guys and i'm not gonna tell you guys which or which or what book i'm gonna show up next so i'll show you you guys will get to see in the next video so see in the next video um, i'll upload these back to back I'll put these like one in one day and then one the next day. So you guys will get to a chance to like focus on that. But hope you guys enjoyed.